Hey everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Kimber and I'm the person behind Kimber's Cozy Creations. And if you're returning, welcome back. Um, this is week three update for Summer Stock Camp and it's gonna be a short one today, but that's okay. I was gonna do it outside. I wanted to film outside, but it's probably about 100 degrees now and just not about that. So we're down in the studio again today. Was down here last week, but pretty dye, bare yarn, all that good stuff. So, um, I've been working all morning on rinsing yarn, dyeing yarn, all that. So I look like a hot mess. I feel like a hot mess, but that's what you're getting. <laughs> um, so I did finish, well first, because I remember last week my camera battery was dying at the very end when I was showing all the ready to ship sock sets and mini sets, which are still 10% off with the code CAMP, C-A-M-P. Um, at checkout in my shop and that's just on the ready to ship sock sets and mini sets um, the stuff I rinsed this morning will wrap up my little mini I don't know I think I'm gonna call it like a summer sock set collection that I have going on um, so all the colorways are finished nailed out I just need to work up samples after even after I'm done filming here I'm going to cake up the first one, maybe two, because I have two empty sock needles right now. Um, socks, yeah, sock needles, and start some samples to get those worked up, because I'm very excited about them. But, since I, <laughs> all over the place today, um, since I was running out of battery last time, I wasn't able to show the stuff that I got from Kay, from Crazy Sock Lady, uh, for her summer sock camp stuff. So I'm going to show that right now before we get into all the socks. So I got three things from her. Two are Summer Sock Camp exclusives, one is not. I got the Notion Tin from K, which was her Summer Sock Camp Notion Tin. Super cute. Has, see if I can show these without spilling them everywhere. Um, it has, oh goodness. A bunch of light bulb stitch markers, little circular ones, and then it also has a uh, darning needle, sewing needle. Let's see if we'll focus back here. No. 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 Oh, there we go. And it has like a little. Oh my goodness. Just a little darning needle, sewing needle. I don't know what you guys want to call them. I usually call them a darning needle. It's not going to focus on that, but oh well. And then it has a bunch of these. There's little light bulbs, stitch markers. They're all rose gold, which is awesome. I like it. Little light bulb stitch markers, and then a couple of the goodness. See if I can even hold these. There we go, I'll go that way. Just a little circle uh, markers, which are, I have one on my nine inch circular, so I know my beginning of round. Um, so I got that, a little notion tin. I'll put everything back in there, there we go. And then the other camp exclusive thing I got was the enamel pin, which is probably gonna get, oh, that's not too bad. There you go, just a little summer sock camp. The logo for this year, just an enamel pin. I saw my um, White Rose Fiber Company bag, which was not a summer sock camp exclusive, but she did have that print at the beginning of the summer. She might still have some, I'll link her shop below. So you can go check it out if it's if you want to. Um, and then the other non-summer sock camp exclusive thing I got was a, um, this little wrist ruler. I got the skinny one because she has like thin, skinnier ones and fatter ones. So I got the skinny, the 18 inch one in the turquoise the teal. I think they called it a teal on. But it has, let me see if I can get this to, to focus there. I don't know how people do this all the time and just get it to focus right away. 
there you go so you can kind of see the the number of measurements on there so it has every every quarter inch is on there so you know it has to focus back to that but then it's just a super cute um super cute bracelet So it's a 16 inch one I got, and then it has super cute magnetic clasp. Oh my goodness. Does not want to focus today at all. It's just the kind of day we're having over here. But anyways, super, super cute. And right now I have it in my, it's just like a little magnetic one. Um, right now it's just in my Notion bag just because I'm dying a lot lately and I just don't want to get it dirty, I guess. Um, but I can definitely see wearing it like on vacation or like on a road trip or something where I know I'm gonna be kind of more relaxed but also knitting a lot more, so measuring stuff. Um, so I will link her shop below. I don't know if she has the Summer Sock Camp stuff still, if there's any left or if she's restocking on those. Um, but the wrist rulers are like a constant thing that she has in the shop. So then there's the teal turquoise. I don't remember what they called it, uh, what she called it on the website. But then they have, I think like a gray one and a brown one, maybe two different shades of brown. And like I said, there's the skinny one and the wider one. And I got the skinnier one. Um, so I'll list a, I'll add a link to her shop in the video description thing, whatever you want to call it and go check it out um i guess also another update with summer sock camp is that i will be i ordered minis on friday thursday friday maybe saturday morning i don't know a couple days ago um so i will be dying up more of my summer sock camp mini sets for k so as soon as i get that bear yarn I'm going to dye it up and then send it back to her so again we don't know a specific date yet but they are in the works they will be dyed up shortly and sent back so as soon as I know kind of when they are and I know when they're updated I'll let you guys know but best option is to go follow Kay the crazy sock lady she'll have the most up-to-date information on that so I think that's all taken care of so I know last week my goal was to finish two pairs of socks, um, but I got one done, so I didn't quite meet that goal, but I got one finished and then the other two made some decent progress on. So the first finished pair, well the only finished pair I guess is the, my lollipop yarns, Mood, so the Mood colorway. Um, so this one was done last week and then I was right here when we, when I filmed last week. So I finished all the foot, heel, turn, and cuff. Um, I finished these, this one last night, so I still haven't woven the ends in yet. I was gonna do that this morning, but then got busy dyeing and rinsing, and now we're here. So, <laughs> um, so those are done. I really like them, they fit really well. I just did a, it's a yarn over toe, where you just like, do the yarn over as an increase and then on the next round you just knit into the back loop uh, and then just a vanilla shadow wrap heel um yeah so shadow wrap heel the yarn over toes i like them so it's like a rounded ish toe i guess it does not want to focus today oh well and then just a two by two cuff um i really liked those they're really nice i still need to get more of her yarn um, maybe I'll get some this week. I don't know, but so those are done. So another pair is done. So now I have two pairs done for summer sock camp so far, two more that are almost there. And then when I get all these samples going, I'll have, oh, there's what, one, two, three, four, five, six. We're going to have six new sock sets. That's exciting. I thought it was like four, apparently it's six now. Um, there's one, two, three, three there, four, five, six, yeah, six new sock sets. So hopefully I'll have those done by the first because I'm planning on having these sock sets listed, the new ones listed 
no later than July 1st. So I'm gonna have to crank those bad boys out, which is fine, because I'll probably just do all of them vanilla-ish, so that's exciting. Anyways, like I said, we're all over the place today. I'm really sorry. Um, just how it's going over here at KCC today, so. If you don't like it, I'm sorry. If you do, well, <laughs> good for you, I guess. I don't know, whatever. Anyways, so then these are my nine inch circulars. So this is where I was last time, last week. So I got, what, three inches, three and a half inches done, which is nice. Again, these are just on uh, nine inch circulars. Um, toe up, obviously. These I'm doing the legal heel on because these are now the boyfriend socks because they're too big for me, which is fine. I'll just have to make myself another pair. Um, but yeah, still, I do, I enjoy the nine inch circulars. It's nice to just be able to keep knitting in the round, go, 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 not have to deal with moving needles around all that stuff. But magic loop two at a time, toe up is still gonna be my go-to. I don't think that's gonna change at all, so. But my hands aren't cramping nearly as much as I was expecting because you always hear people complain about how much their hands hurt when they're doing nine inch circulars. I don't seem to be having that problem, which is really nice. So I can definitely see like when they'd be good to use. And I do keep, like have them in the back pocket, use when I need to type of thing. So yeah, there we go. And then the other one that I am working on is the wildflower seeds pattern in Mandy's Makings Picking Wildflower Picking Wildflowers Share a Pair. So last time, so this one I had like four or five rows of the cuff done, that was it. So we got through the cuff, did the, oh my goodness, heel turn, there we go. Heel turn, now I'm working on the gusset decreases. Um, I think I only have like 12 more rows, rounds, whatever left for the decreases, the gusset decreases, and then it's just the foot and the toe. So hopefully those don't take too long. I'm really enjoying this pattern, so I don't mind it at all. Oh my goodness. Yep, that's not gonna focus. Anyways, it's in my two week one recap, week two? I don't know, I showed a very good close up in one of the other ones. But yeah, so I guess that's where I'm at this week. Um, goals for next week are gonna be finish this one in the nine inch circular, so finish two pairs. And then maybe we'll say one sample set. Maybe, I think with, yeah, one sample set. And then as I finish those, I'll show them to you. But they're all gonna be launched at the same time. So like as I finish samples, I'll show them, share them with you guys just so you can see them, kind of get excited about them. But then they will be up in the shop all at the same time. So that's kind of the plan. Um, I think that's it for this week. I said super short, crazy over here. So just trying to get it in. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys next week. Bye.